Hello, this is Gretchen Alley with your guided meditation to reset your chakras. This meditation will clear your chakras from old blockages and energies that no longer serve your greater good. It does have Reiki in it, so please acknowledge you are receiving Reiki with this video. Do not do this meditation while you're driving or operating machinery, only when you can safely relax in your own space without being disturbed or distracted. I'll invite you to pause this video and get your room set up, lower the lights, make sure you're going to be warm and comfortable for the next little bit, light your incense, grab your water, set your phone to silent, and set your alarms that you may need. After that's done, get yourself set into a comfortable posture. We will begin with breath work, a body systems talk down, followed by the meditation. If you fall asleep, that's okay. You'll receive the full benefits. Feel the ground beneath you supporting you. As we enter into this meditative experience, I invite you to welcome all sensations, thoughts, and feelings as messengers along your true path. Become aware of your natural state of being, one of love, bravery, and calmness. Your ever presence, essence of peace and wisdom is always there. I am grounded, I am balanced, I am safe and secure, I am aware and at ease. Feel the earth beneath you supporting you. Taking a few cleansing breaths here, inhaling through your nose, exhaling through your mouth, inhaling as big as you can into your stomach, pausing slightly, long, loud, slow exhales, pausing slightly, three big breaths like that, and go ahead, I'll wait. beautiful. Now turn your attentions to any sounds you may hear. Do not focus on them or name them, just acknowledge them. Beginning with sounds outside this building. Sounds inside the building. Sounds inside this room. of you. Bringing your attention to your crown chakra. On the inhale, your body will be filled with a cleansing, healing, loving white light. And on the exhale, your body will begin to deeply relax. Feel the relaxation beginning at the top of your head. little muscles behind your eyes and eyebrows, relaxing your cheeks, and your face, your jaw, relax your tongue from the roof of your mouth, Feel the breath escaping your lips as your jaw and chin relax. Relaxing the back of your head, your throat, your shoulders and shoulder blades. Relaxation flows down your arms, wrists, hands, and fingers. Relaxing your right and left chest. Your 
near your upper abdomen. Near middle abdomen. Near lower abdomen. Relaxation flows into your upper back. Near lower back. Flowing down your entire spine. Relaxing your right side body. In your left side body. Allow your lower abdomen to relax again. Relaxing your right and left groin. Your entire pelvic floor. Your buttocks relax. Your hips. Thighs. Knees. Relaxing your ankles, feet, and toes. Relaxation flows into your entire right leg. Into your entire left leg. Your entire body. your entire body. Your entire body is relaxed. You are in a protective bubble full of white healing light. See yourself on a high cliff top sparse vegetation and dry dirt around you, surrounded by a vast purple and blue sky. That sky right before and right after the sun rises and sets. You have a small cauldron in front of you. As you stand, you are filling the cauldron with energies that no longer serve you, filling it with the things that block your chakras. We'll begin at your root chakra, pulling from you the feelings of greed, jealousy, selfishness, insecurity, and addictions, releasing from that root chakra into the cauldron, releasing those limited views, that general distrusting, release feeling separate, filling the cauldron with these things. Pulling them away from the root chakra, taking them far away from your body. All of it is taken from your body and you feel it leaving you as it enters this cauldron.
standing on that cliff with a cauldron in front of you. If you look down, you see all of those things that are no longer in you. They're beginning to fill that cauldron. It's got a little bit in there. We move on to your sacral chakra. You pull from you compulsions, obsessions, releasing the need to control, releasing addictions, guilt, and jealousy into that cauldron, letting those emotions fill the cauldron, releasing traumas from your childhood, releasing negative thoughts about sex, releasing the past, letting that depression leave your body, releasing those feelings of feeling less, letting go of feeling like you have to own everything. All of this is taken from your body. You feel it leaving you and you see it filling the cauldron in front of you on that high cliff top with the sparse vegetation and dry dirt around you, the vast purple and blue sky. You see you pulling the compulsion and obsessions, the control and the addiction, the guilt and the jealousy. All of that falls away from you and fills the cauldron. You feel a bit lighter. Those blockages from your root and your sacral chakra have been taken from your body. You feel them continuing to leave you. You see them continuing to feel the cauldron in front of you. You take a deep breath here. And you feel the healing powers of Mother Earth rising up into the bottom of your feet and beginning to fill your body with those healing powers from Mother Gaia. Moving on to your solar plexus chakra. You begin the work pulling from your body anger, pulling from your body the need to dominate and control. You continue to release ego into that cauldron, releasing the need for more stuff releasing the need to be everything to everyone, releasing your lack of confidence, pulling those suppressed emotions from your body, feeling those suppressed emotions, feeling that extra leave your body, those things, those blockages that don't serve you, pulling them from your body and filling the cauldron with these feelings. Feel them leaving you physically, all of it releasing into the cauldron, allowing yourself to cry if you need to. See yourself standing there on the cliff. Dry dirt, sparse vegetation, that brilliant purple and blue sky around you. See yourself pull from your heart chakra, that big center of self, physically pulling the blockages to fill that cauldron in front of you. You see your releases beginning at your heart chakra on that cliff top. 
beginning to release resentment and bitterness, releasing shyness, releasing all the negative feelings about yourself. Let go of that lack of self-love and intolerance. You fill that cauldron with unresolved grief, depression. You let go of ties to people who emotionally control you and your choices. You fill the cauldron with your fears of intimacy and codependency. You let it all go into that cauldron and you feel it being taken from your body as it enters the cauldron, feeling lighter, releasing those blockages. that magical version of you move on to your throat chakra allowing the feelings of self-betrayal the fear of speaking and self-expression you see those go into the cauldron you release the abrupt words the anger the need to be a chatterbox the need to be a center of attention you release the fear of being judged you see physically see yourself pulling the quiet, timid, weak voice from your throat chakra. You see it going into the cauldron, leaving you strong and powerful. You no longer ignore your will or your inner voice. You see the gossiping, lying, and worries about silence leave you. It leaves your body and it fills your cauldron. You feel them leave you. Taking another deep, deep breath, deep, deep breath, pulling those healing powers of Mother Gaia, Mother Earth, through your feet chakras into your entire body, allowing it to fill, heal, and soothe all those open, empty spaces that you've released into the cauldron. And moving up to your third eye, you see your magical self on that cliff top in that white protective light with a cauldron in front of you, the purple and blue sky around you, releasing from your third eye into the cauldron. You see the release of nightmares and confusion, muddled thinking, being judgmental, just leaving you. You see ego, leave your third eye. You release being unable to think for yourself. You release your own negative perceptions of people and situations. You release rigid thinking patterns. You release prejudices towards people and situations. You release the rejection of your own intuition. You see it falling out of that third eye. See them filling the cauldron. See the doubts. The limiting beliefs leave your third eye. 
cleansing that psychic center, releasing those blockages, allowing you to grow as a beautiful healing soul, filling that cauldron. See your magical self move up to your crown chakra. You see yourself standing on the cliff, the cauldron in front of you. It's almost full now. There is still room for more release. You see yourself, the releases beginning from your crown chakra into the cauldron, releasing ego and ignorance, allowing your depression, anxiety, fears, and confusion to go away into this cauldron. You release living in the past and the fear of death. You release insomnia. You release closed-mindedness. You stop being overly skeptical. You see that falling into the cauldron. The feelings of isolation and loneliness leave you. You see them. You also see them leaving your crown chakra, filling the cauldron. You feel them leave your body, feeling lighter. Taking another breath, inhaling those healing powers of Mother Gaia, you feel them fill your entire body and soothe all those empty, achy spots. You see yourself standing there on the cliff, the cauldron in front of you, brilliant blue and purple sky around. You bend down and you pick up the cauldron by its handle, holding it with both hands. You begin to turn in a circle with it, swinging the cauldron with you, feeling a lift higher off of the ground. You feel the muscles of your back arch and the toes of your feet dig into the ground as you let loose all of the contents of the cauldron. The contents fly out. You let out a primal scream. The liquid that was in the cauldron disperses separates into 10 million tiny droplets that spread far, far out into the sky, slowly dissipating until they are completely gone. You feel a sensation, weight lifted from your heart, from your body. You feel light and happy. You feel grounded and balanced. You feel peaceful and powerful. You blink. Suddenly you are no longer on that cliff. You are under a waterfall, a warm waterfall, 
smiling as the water is hammered down upon you, cleansing the last of the energies you need to let go, filling your heart, filling your bodies, every cell of your body fills with pure love and joy from these warm waters imbuing into you, allowing pure peace, Shambhala, to fall down. Shambhala falls into your cells. Shambhala falls into your aura, into all of your bodies. Shambhala, peace and love fill every cell of your entire